Well, hi, I'm Peter. Welcome to my garage where we got set up to play racquetball and we both have Parkinson's. I'm 53. I was diagnosed eight years ago with Parkinson's on my right side, so I play with my right side because I can do good exercise on that side. And I'm Kevin. And I was diagnosed about five years ago. Uh, I'm 70 years old and like Peter, uh, my right side is the one that's impacted the most. And Kevin wants to talk about how it feels to play racquetball and then we'll show you actually how we do play it here in the garage. Uh, just to make a point, like when we're out here concentrating on going after the ball, we tend to forget the uh, Parkinson's symptoms. And, uh, in some cases, it's, it's like we don't even have the, uh, the symptoms at all. But uh, it's good. So it's good exercise, but it's also your mind gets lost in the chasing the ball. So it's, it's, it's really good for a couple of different things. Psychologically, it's good, but it's also just good for your body. So we're going to show you how to play. Before we play, there's two things you really need to know to set up your own racquetball court in your garage. One is you need to get some plastic sheets that are made like made for science, like for election campaigns, and put those sheets on the wall if you have any boxes or things that the ball can get lost in. And so you have to put the sheets on both sides. We use the garage door itself to, to be the, the, the main wall, and we bounce off the side wall with those plastic sheets. The second thing is a squishy ball. Kevin's holding that up. It's a ball that's a little squishier than ordinary because the racquetball, as you know, is quite hard and that's much too fast for a smaller confined like this. So this is a typical garage that's a double garage for two cars and there's enough room to play a decent game of racquetball. Are you ready to play? Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, the thing about playing in the garage is sometimes it hits the hinge on the door, which is a bit of a nuisance, <laughs> but it doesn't happen very often. This is my daughter Hannah, she's our ball girl. She goes collects the balls sometimes when we drop it. Thank you, Hannah. See ya. See ya. Hi, welcome to my garage. We've made a racquetball court in my garage for people who like to play Parkinson's. I'm Peter, I'm 52 years old. And <laughs> Parkinson's, okay. I get it, I get it. <laughs>